the Bula Ads tutorial. Hello and welcome to our channel. On this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the Bula Ads. So please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial. And to create an account in the Bula, you could also use my affiliate link below the description where in a small commission at no additional cost to you. And by using the link, you may also get some discount or rewards upon sign up. But before that, if you don't know what is Tabula, it is a leading discovery platform that helps advertisers reach their target audience through personalized content recommendation across a vast network of publisher, website, and apps, in which with its advanced AI technology, Tabula analyzes user interest and content consumption patterns to surface the most relevant recommendations to each individual user, driving higher engagement and better campaign performance for advertisers. And it also offers a variety of features including an exclusive partnership with top publishers, enabling advertisers to reach over 1 billion users worldwide each month. And now to sign up on tabula.com, you could also use my affiliate link below the description in which upon clicking on those affiliate link, you will be directed on this sign up section. And from here, all you need to do is to fill out all of these account details including your email address, your first name, last name, select your country, enter your mobile phone number, your website, your company name, and also below here you could also select your company sizes with here 1 to 50 employees and many more. And below you could also select what kind do you want to advertise. You select with here search ads, social media display and native and many more. And after that just check all of these boxes if you want to or disagree to the terms and condition and click this create account button to proceed. And after that just check your inboxes to activate your account on Tabula. So just go to your email inboxes and from here, you seem to click this create your first campaign. Upon clicking on it, you will automatically be directed on this two-step verification in which you can choose either to verify through email, SMS, or through app. However, in those given option, I'm going to select or choose to verify using my email address. Upon clicking the save button, you will automatically be directed on this page right here. And as you can see under this table ads, it will show you the campaigns and below here it will show you other details upon creating a campaign. Web here, the campaigns, ads, sites, and many more. While on the top panel, you could also navigate these tracking audiences, rules, and reports. And now to proceed creating a campaign on this table ads, just proceed by clicking this create campaign button in here. In which upon clicking on it, we will automatically be directed on this page in which on the left side panel under this campaign settings all we need to do is to simply fill out including this campaign setup the campaign name for example i'm going to enter here the campaign which is the campaign name of drug addiction and after that below here under brand name you could also enter the name of your product brand or website but at this point the website that i'm going to use is this helpguide.org so i'm just going to enter here helpguide.org so basically, all of this is important since creating a campaign serves a multiple purposes primarily in at achieving specific marketing objectives that align with the business overall goals. And now below, just choose your marketing objective with here lead generation, online purchases, website engagement, and brand awareness, and many more. And in those options, I'm going to choose this brand awareness. Now below here, we could also select our account default. And below the schedule, we could also select the different kind of time frame that we want I'm going to select this is start running as soon as approved. All the days is 24 7 and the status is active. Now, under this campaign targeting, it will show you in here your target location for this campaign. You could also enter here or select multiple location. For instance, I'm going to select the country United States. So, from here, all we need to do is simply enter here the name or spell it United States and also United Kingdom. And next, Australia. So as you can see, after selecting your targeting country, below here you could also include some other region or state, or even all of this entire country. Now under this platform, you could also select your target specific platforms with your desktop, mobile, or even tablet platforms. But I'm going to choose this desktop. While under this operating system, I'm going to include this Android, Linux, Mac OS, Windows. And after selecting your operating system, you could also select the browser. Or your target specific browsers maybe here chrome edge safari and many more so you can simply select here multiple choices and after that after selecting all of this browser under this contextual targeting you could also select a segments in here 
target the categories with your art and entertainment, autos and vehicles, beauties and fitness, and I'm going to choose this health. By checking all of these categories, we can now proceed by filling out all of this below, including this topic or segment. But if you don't have one, you could also click this create topic segment, then you will be directed on the next tab in which it will show you how to create a new segment. Now under audience targeting, we could also under here or select this 1P or 3P partner audiences, or even select your audiences in here. And after filling out all of this required information, just click this next button below here to proceed. And now for the step 2 which is budget and bidding, from here you could also enter here your daily or your budget in which budgeting and bidding are crucial components in the creation of marketing campaign significantly impacting its effectiveness and overall success. So for instance, under this budget, our daily budget is 100 US dollar. And now for the spending limit of monthly budget, make sure that the monthly limit must be larger than a daily budget. So for instance, instead of $100, we're going to enter here 30,000 US dollar as its monthly limit or budget. So basically, this is spending limit. It ensures that spending aligns with business goals, allowing marketers to track expenses against expected returns. And now under this ad optimization, from here you could also select even optimize or A-B testing. But in those option, I'm going to select this optimize, which is recommended. Now moving on below here, under custom rules, you could also select or associate predefined rules with this campaign. While under this tracking, it will show you the tracking code in which this code will be added to your landing page URL so you will be able to track campaign performance and other analytic platforms. And now to proceed by clicking this create campaign button below here, it will automatically create it. However, if you have a core an error in here, it will show you on the top panel the error. So all you need to do from here is to simply go back and change the error. And it says here that our error is only under the spending limit and budget. And after customizing those one, we can now proceed by creating our campaign. In which the next thing that we need to do is to simply add a payment method in here. And which we will be able to be directed on this page, all we need to do is to simply add our credit card and also our billing address. In which this is basically the last step in creating a campaign on this platform, Tabula Ads. So after filling out all of this record information, your payment methods, you will now start creating your campaign. And from here you could also select different guide payment methods. And it will show in here your recent payments history and also your current spend. Moving on on the top panel, you could also navigate this tracking to track all of your activity, including the conversion statuses and other conversion in here that will show you the status of those kind of activities. Now moving on to this audiences, from here it will show you all of your audience that you could also add one if you want to by clicking this new audience and also navigate this custom audiences, topic segments, and combine audiences. While for the rules, by clicking on it, from here you could also start creating your new rule. All you need to do is to simply fill out all of this record information to do so. And for the reports, by clicking the reports option, from here you could also schedule your reports by clicking this button and fill out all of this record information in order to start creating your scheduled reports. But overall, the rest is basically how you can use Tabula ads. Thank you.